Hey everyone, this is Seth from Tech Talk, and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to install VirtualBox on any Mac. And that includes if you're running the 10.13.6 Mac High Sierra. This video is for you as well. So stick around, let me show you how to get this done real quick. So if you're looking to install VirtualBox on a newer Mac, and that means like 10.15 and above, all you have to do is open, click the link in the description below and once it opens click downloads here and then you're going to just click mac os intel host and then you'll see it download up here now if you don't have a newer mac you're going to want to go to the other link that i'm providing it's in the description as well copy that and paste it in the browser above and um, trust me people this is really simple to do so um, go down here to virtual 6.146 osx.dmg click on that and then you're going to see it download up here as well. the download has completed so let's go ahead and click the arrow and I'm just going to double click on this now you'll see that it's verifying and in a moment it will open up now you'll see this here. Now we're going to click VirtualBox. Now keep in mind, some of you are going to want to stick around because we may have to change some security settings to make this work. But it's really simple. So let me show you how to get it done. So you'll double click the VirtualBox package. And um, we're going to go ahead and hit continue. And we'll hit continue here. Click install. And now it's going to require your password. Just type it in. And then click enter. And now it's done. I'm going to go ahead and hit close. Now, if any of you had trouble where you had a security warning, go ahead and go up to here to the Apple. Go, go system preferences. And then you're going to do security and privacy. And once that opens up, you're going to be on the general tab. You might see something down here that says allow. You're going to have to allow it. I already did this before, so it didn't have me do that. But I'm pretty sure it's going to make you do that. So just keep that in mind. If you have any trouble, just please leave me a comment below. I'll be more than happy to help you out. So now we can just go into the applications. I'll close this. I inadvertently opened that. Go ahead and open the applications. And now you'll see virtual boxes in here. Double click it. And, and that's pretty much it. As you can see, it's running, and you can add a new um, new machine. And that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, please leave me a comment below. Please consider hitting like and subscribe, and you can support the channel by um, maybe purchasing a super or maybe some um, merchandise. All right, have a great day, my friends.